Holy sh Hold on. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> That's even worse. I don't like. I don't like the sound of that. Nope. Nothing no, good happens. No, I just. Off of I've that. never been able to actually play this. Oh. And then considering if maybe I want to do this instead. Do the thing you've never done. That's way more fun. What's cracking, everybody? We have a super cool game for you, which many people have asked on different places of the interwebs, and that is a battle with the nitpicking nerds. You made a real run on sentence there. I did. We've got me. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Mia and VZ from Nitpicking Nerds. So, yeah, here's a here's a here's a game, and we're playing against them. And it's gonna be great. You should watch it. <laughs> Players' decks. Hi, my name is Mia Largo of the Nitpicking Nerds. We run a commander channel on YouTube. Today, I'm gonna be playing Zafai Thunder Conductor. I'm gonna be trying to get a lot of value off of my spells that I play, scrying a lot, and then just dealing random big damage with high CMC spells that I cast. I'm BZ, AKA Buzzy, AKA Breezy, joined by Amber with Svella. I'm gonna be making some ice cubes, hopefully uh, cubing people out to death. Today I'm playing General Tazri, it's allies. I was gonna try to make a pun, but I'd make one in the comments for me after the fact, it's fine. It's allies and there's lots of them and they all do stuff and it confuses me, but it's fine. I'm playing dinosaurs. I've decided that Wyatt's first deck, whether he likes it or not, is gonna be dinosaurs. So yeah, Pantlatsa, she's cool. It's a dinosaur, it does things, it discovers and that's busted. So I'm gonna do that bunch. Elder Dragon Hijinx is proudly sponsored by Cool Stuff Inc. Be sure to check them out for all your singles and sealed needs. If you're thinking about picking up the new murders at Call of Mana Commander Precons, use our code HIJINX at checkout for 5% off your orders and to let Cool Stuff Inc. know that we sent you. The link to Cool Stuff Inc. is in the description below. I win? Yes! King of going last. That's probably the only thing I'm gonna win today, so, you know, I'll take him where I can get him. I will draw. Yay! Look at me, I'm such a good magic player. All right, I'm gonna play Thriving Bluff. It is going to be uh, plains and mountains, so that's my Boris land, and that's my go. All right. Sheltered Thicket Pass. <laughs> Drawing for turn, I'm going to play Swiftwater Cliffs, gaining one life and passing. Wow, I'm gonna draw. Not only do I have the first untap land of the game, but I have the first play with an Elvish Mystic. And I'm gonna oh, pass. Get him. Public it's enemy over. number one. <laughs> it's almost as bad as Sol Ring turn one. It's worse. <laughs> it's a green Sol Ring, you know. I will then play this here, Timely Forest. Tap, tap. And I would too would like to ramp. So I'm gonna Thunder Herd Migration as an additional cost to cost. The spell reveal a dino or pay one. You can see this lovely Verdant Sun's avatar. So I will go get a basic, put it onto the battlefield tap, then shuffle. That's my go. Untap. I got this here, forest. Shiny. Mm -hmm. Those are nice little arts. Yeah, I like them. Uh, exotic Orchard. I'll tap two for an Orin Reef Survivalist. Uh, whenever it or another ally enters the battlefield, under my control, it gets a 1-1 one -one counter. Pass. Untap, drawing for turn. I am going to play an island and I'll tap two for a walking atlas. I can tap it to put a land card from my hand onto the battlefield and pass my turn. Oh, that's nifty. All right, untap, upkeep, drop. Go to combat, go to second main, play a Mossfire Valley, and I'll bring out Svella, and I'll pass. Yeah, Svella! That's my favorite girl. What a lady. She's great. I have untapped. I am going to play this lovely mountain, and then I like dinosaurs. So let's pay four to get this curious Altasaur out. It's a Vigi Reach 2 5. Whenever a dinosaur deals combat damage to a player, dinosaur I control, draw a card. <laughs> It's nice. Critter draw. That's my turn. Mia, can you tap for a white? I cannot. I am playing Izzet. Oh, okay. You've got Izzet. Okay. I can tap for a white. You've got one though? Great. All right. Exotic Orchard for white. Lantern Scout. Get a counter here. This friend will gain lifelink. Ooh. Ooh. Ha ha. You can't hit me. Ha ha. <laughs> I can. I'm choosing not to. I will pass. Okay. 
I'm going to tap and draw. I am going to play land for turn, tap two, and I will play an arcane signet, and I will tap two, and I'll play a talisman. Oh, nice. And I think I will pass for turn after that. Lord, she <laughs> <ma'am>. Okay. <laughs> I, will, I will also try to do some rampies. I'm going to play basic forest. Me and Olivia have the same style of basic forest. It must mean that we're friends. Uh, let's make... not be hasty. Okay. I was like, uh, there can only be one. I thought that was the rule. I tried. <laughs> All right. I'm going to throw an overgrowth on this forest so it makes cool. extra green green. And that's going to be it for me. So wait. I will untap. Draw. Yeah, let's do it. All right. Uh, come on, tower. The Jurassic Park one. Ooh, that's green. the nice mm. one. Flaxen. Yeah, there was so much nice art in that last set. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Oh, I could use the other side, too. I keep forgetting that. I am going to pay whoop, five for Hunt Latza. So, whenever this lovely friend or another dinosaur enters the battlefield under my control, I can discover X where X is that creature's toughness. So, we're going to discover four. Let's discover the rampant growth. Yes. There you go. All right, we're going to ramp. You Let's discovered go. it. Sweet. I sure discovered a rampant growth. So, I will search for a basic land, put it onto the battlefield, tap and shuffle. I'll do... Yeah, I should do that first because combat will... Draw me cards. I'm going to get this here at Lovely Plains. Boop. Okay. I would like to... Mia, how big is your Atlas buddy there? A one one. A one? Okay. I'm swinging at you for two. Dink. I'll take two. Tis but a scratch and you have the most life. So ha! I will draw True, true. Because my sense. dino says I may. And that's my go. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. Oh, so on time. I'll play a forest... I will tap one to pay, play a soul ring. Ooh. Super on time. I will tap four for a door of destinies, choosing allies. Ooh. Uh, so whenever I cast an ally spell, it gets a counter. Creatures of the chosen type get one one for each counter on door of destinies. Yep, passing. Okay, uh, end step. I'm going to pay to put Castle Vantress down, coming untapped because I control an island. And I will pay one and one colorless i'm gonna reality shift and i'm gonna choose fella what this is Catch. uh i'm gonna respond make an ice cube pre-made and then so this gets exiled mm-hmm. i'm gonna cry about it and then i manifest the top card as a tutu yep i will look wow it's a Heck doozy damn. and then i'll move to turn that was ridiculous ice cube, nice. it's dangerous okay not anymore this fella's so much fun <laughs> it's okay. She's gonna come back uh, later with a vengeance when he's got haste for her somehow. Oh, she will. <laughs> yeah, I will play land for turn, and I will pay one, two, three. I'll just have like that. And I will play Zafai onto the field. Mm, is there anything else I want to do? I can't get over how much that guy looks like uh, Samuel L. Jackson. So every, every <laughs> I never time it's played, I want to go Zafai, motherfucker. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to pass after that. All right. I'll untap without my commander. Perfect. Oh, thanks. Anything. I'll I'll draw. Is there a rule in EDH hijinks against pop stopping? Uh, Because Mia must be doing it. (laughs) No, it wasn't in the rule zero talk, so (laughs) I'm going to say it's five. She's sitting next to me and she's pop stopping. To be fair, I did say if you can kill someone, go for it. So yeah. How how you you get there, though, is up to you. In fact, encouraged, he said. <laughs> All right. I've been hurt before, but I'm going to cast Spella, Ice Shaper. She's back. She's back. Maybe he swords it. It'll be really funny. <laughs> <laughs> no, please. Goodness me. I will decline to attack with my tutu and pass. Wow. Yeah, I woke up and chose violence. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Brave. <laughs> That's her Hello, default setting. Oh, you're very late, but I suppose you're on time. I know he took it out, but he's gotten the uh, flip a tolly out of that deck. So. It's not in here anymore. I know. I'm just saying you got powerful stuff in there. I know the power I, of Smella. I was thinking about putting it in this deck, but I was like, nah, I've done it already. It's boring now. So I will play this here mountain. And we're going to get some chonkers out. Let's brick, brick, tap seven for Verdant Sun's Avatar. Oh. Whenever this or another creature enters the battlefield under your control, gain life equal to that creature's toughness. I will gain five and become the target. And Pantlatza, well, this actually hasn't entered yet, but yeah, I will discover five. Whoop. Oh, <laughs> okay. These are quick uh, discoveries. <laughs> I guess I'm going to go find some more land. Yeah, like the freaking pioneers here. 
So I'm gonna look for a Plains, Island, Swamp, or Mountain. Put on the Battlefield tap, then Shuffle. Then the centers gain the five. Go to combat. The five is how big? A one four. A one four? Okay. I mean, I feel bad bullying you, but I, I feel like you'll let me through the most. Olivia also probably would, so. No. I was like, like, BZ won't let you through? Well, yeah. BZ would. I don't... I'm desperate. I'll, okay. I can do anything. Mia, you're gonna get Pantlatsa coming at you, and Curious Altasaur at BZ. All right. Uh, I'm going to block yeah, with just, this manifest. Right. Okay, uh, take Mark does for commander. Yes. But then, what you didn't know is this was a mountain. Oh, uh-huh. it was a mountain all along. I see my dinosaurs are just great at finding land. I will draw. I need to go find my land. I'll do that now and pause. Hmm. I'm going to get Sacred Foundry. Um, I will tap two. <laughs> One f- uh, exotic will be a blue. Uh, for Halimar Excavator, I'll get a counter here, I'll get a counter here. Excavator is whenever it or another ally enters the battlefield under my control, target player puts the top X of cards of his or her library into the graveyard. X is the number of allies, control, that's three. Ailey. Hi, yes. Mill three. Oh, hang on, I'm still shuffling. Yeah, when you're done. Uh, I'm done, no combat. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to untap and draw for turn. I'm going to play Mana Geyser. How many tap Oof. lands does oh, everyone gosh. control? I have four. <laughs> Eight. Two. Okay, You're so 14 welcome. total. Thank you. <laughs> so uh, 14, 14 red mana. <laughs> Let's see. It's very I'll, many lands. Yeah. I'll pay one. I will hit myself for one blue here, going down to 34. And then I will use three of these, so going down to 11 red mana. And I'm going to Just play, oh, sorry. I should trigger and Zephy. Before I do anything, I You make, should scry and get a 4-4? Four, four? Yeah, I get a 4-4, four, four, and I'll scry one, because this actually doesn't matter. Yeah. But, well, if it matters, you're not allowed to do it. And then tapping, I will pour over the pages. So, oh. trigger again. I'll make another 4-4, four, four, and I will draw these in a second. I'm going to scry one more. Put that on the bottom. So, I'm going to draw three. I will discard an island. I'll help you out. Oh, yeah. And then I'll also uh, untap one, two. Thanks, thanks for drawing for me. This might be a <laughs> hijinks first, taking what? the token from someone else's board. Yeah, there we go. Well, no, it's unfortunately our, not. Yeah. I've done it to Brian before. Yeah, she's run to the other room and stolen things off his table. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I think I will use some of this mana. I'll pay two blue here, this, and then two more red so it doesn't fizzle, because this is a lot of mana. And I will scry two. That, that's good. I like I like those two. And then I think I am going to use to combat and have this fizzle because I have not much more I want to do with it. Rest in pepperoni is red mana. Hmm. I I know my heart, my soul. Mm. I think I'll pass after that. So wait, you used five mana and you made fourteen mana. But then you wasted nine mana? Look, I was looking for stuff. <laughs> is, is it that just... <laughs> that's five. I was that's... looking for stuff, and I also got triggers off of it. So <laughs> I thought I'd draw maybe Look, a little bit better off for the pages. You killed Svella. You get no... I'm just going to BM <laughs> for the rest of the game. <laughs> Call all of your game actions into question. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, swing at me, so please, please. Oh, yeah. Right. What do I look like? A fool? Yes. No. Oh. <laughs> I guess I set myself up. Don't ask questions you don't want to answer, Buzzy. Check this out. Yeah. Pass my turn. How about that? <laughs> wow. You know, <laughs> you know, I love it. who could have seen that coming? <laughs> Come at me. Svella player. Recognize the Svella player. <laughs> oh, yeah. Spin that wheel. On tap. I will draw a magic card. Oh, look at all these little dorks I'm drawing so late. I mean, Absolute gas, yes. Mm. <laughs> I'm going to place a clue to courtyard naming dinosaurs. And then, yeah, sure. One, two, three. I'm going to cast Death Gorge Scavenger. As so a Death Gorge Scavenger will enter and it will exile target card from a graveyard. I'm going to assume you've got ways to bring things back from your yard there, Mia. So I'm going to exile whatever your juiciest spell is. Probably four over the pages. Or that sure reality shift. Now yeah, it's important pages. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so if a non-creature card is exiled, it gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. I will gain two life because of Bird and Sun's avatar, and I will discover two. So let's see. Okay. 
Let's see, we need two drop. Hope Four it's a ramp spell. Yeah, I think I've got them all, actually. Okay, that's a big dinosaur. Do I have any more two drop things, or have I found them all? I know I have a soul ring in here somewhere. Wow. Okay, hey, there we go. Cool. Woo. Arcane Siggy, let's go. Bonk! On the board. And then these go... I'm gonna go one, two... To cast Drobo of the Mighty. It gets plus two, plus two, as long as I control a dinosaur, and it is a mana dork. Yay. Okay. So I shall move to the combat step. My dinosaurs are trained in, uh, I don't know, Muay Thai. <laughs> Jiu Jitsu. I don't know. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, they, they only know fights. So let's go. Olivia. Yes. Have a 5-5. Five five. Mia, have a 4-4. Four four. And BZ What do you get for this. your 5-5 five five getting through? I draw cards, which is probably not a good thing. Block a 4-4 four four with a 4-4? Four four? <sighs> Crap, you had that. I forgot you had elementals, but it's fine. It dies and goes back to the commander. Well, I was going to do this anyway. Um, I will collected company really quick. Ooh, Coco. Oh, Coco, nice. Dead. I will put a core blade whirl out. Whenever core blade whirl or another ally you control enters the battlefield under you control, creatures you control gain first strike oh. until end of turn. Convenient. Uh, they'll also gain lifelink, get to plus one, plus one counters, and Orin Reef Survivalist will get uh, another counter. Bye bye, So dinosaur. the Survivalist is a 7-7 seven, seven lifelinking first strike. <laughs> I will block with it. Oh, you Do you want to block too, with right? everything? Well, you only have one thing coming at me. I know, but you'll gain more life if you block with everything. I don't want to block with everything because you could choose to kill two of them. No, I have your first strike. Oh, yeah, that's right. I can literally do nothing. I love this for me. So, yeah, I guess I'll block with a 4-4. Four, four. I will block with a 3-5. I will block with a 5-4 and a 7-7. Seven, seven. So, 19? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is fine. The problem. I yeah. just like turning things sideways. I sure do. On tap. <laughs> oh, fine. I'll just skip over my second main phase. I'm fine. I thought you were done. <laughs> if you untap with enough confidence, it's your turn. That is true. They just go before. I'll do it again. Yeah, I go. So you didn't have anything. That is you energy. Our small players just are running on the same energy of yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> Pass. This is the best show. <laughs> I'm going to tap the exotic orchard for white and play reconnaissance. I'm going to tap four and play a chasm guide. It or an ally enters the battlefield. They all gain haste. Ooh. Uh, breezy, you're going to mill five. Fiber? I'm going to get a counter Go here. Go. <laughs> Ooh, I've buzzy better, five. yeah, let's do buzzy. <laughs> I was thinking of the Super Mario RPG difficulty of Breezy, and so I just thought <laughs> easy why. I was like, that must be it, sorry about that. It's okay, sometimes the fans say, guy on the right. Oh, nice, yeah. Uh, everybody gains haste, everybody gains first strike, everybody has lifelink. This deck is just slivers here. in disguise. No, it's I think it is. Not for in disguise. That, for that slight, I may just come at you. <laughs> <laughs> At 40, oh wait, I'm at 59. Anyway, you're at 47. I'm gonna do what Ailey does and turn everything sideways. Uh huh. Yep. So there's a 9-9 nine, nine lifelink, a 6-5 lifelink, a 4-6 lifelink, a 5-5 five, five lifelink, and a 6-5 lifelink. And they're all buff because of the Door of Destinies. Yes, and then three from the Door of Destinies. And then I can also remove them if you choose to do shenanigans. Aren't you so, proud of me? I'm turning I'm things sideways. Good job. Good it's job. that sort of game. You're, you're growing. I'm regressing. <laughs> <laughs> What's your biggest one? I'll just stick the Door of Destinies in the way. Yeah. Yeah, no tramplies. The rest I'll take. So you're taking 21. Mm. Wow, damn. Cool, 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 cool. I was like how you said 612 and I just saw the numbers tick down like as you said. <laughs> uh, <laughs> as combat finishes, I will reconnaissance, remove them all from combat, untap them. I hate that card so much. Good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Uh, good. Yeah, I think that's enough. Okay. Okay, wow. and then they, everybody had lifelink, so I gained the full gamut from that also, correct? Producer friend. Yeah, just a million. It was 30 total. So, uh, dear nitpicking nerds, please. Yes. In the Olivia problem, we have. Hey, I got Svella untapped. <laughs> Anything's the possible. Olivia problem? What are you guys talking about? What is, <laughs> I'm playing fair magic with creatures. <laughs> okay. So. She's just so, showing you how to turn things sideways. Yeah. 
Yeah. You keep asking me. I'm just showing you I can do it. I'm getting schooled. But you, you <laughs> asked for this. So I'm going to paint red and blue. I'm going to play Galvanic Iteration. Whenever I cast my next instant sorcery this turn, I'm going to copy it and choose new co- targets for the copy. Trigger on Zephy. I'll put this here. And uh, I scryed one. So next, I'm going to hit myself for one for a red, another red, and two blue. Not that the blue red matters, but two of any color. I'm going to play Unexpected Windfall. Nice. Discarding Lightning Bolt. I'm so you going get two to, scries. I was going to keep this on top anyways. So I'll draw two and create two treasure tokens. Yes. And I will do that again. Yeah. But you don't have to it's discard the copy. second time because that's neat. I'll discard Haughty Jin. I love that guy. <laughs> yeah, makes pretty, cool, pretty cool guy. Time. Every time. <laughs> okay, what are the stats you have, Olivia? Like, <laughs> Too much. You have so much right now. I have a 9-9, uh, a uh, six, five, six, five, four, six, and a 5-5. Five, five. Jeez. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, yeah, I think I, think I will just <laughs> pay... One and then three treasures here. For four total, I'll play Wildfire Devils. When it ETBs at the beginning of my upkeep, I choose a player at random. That player exiles an instant sorcery card from their graveyard, and I can copy and cast it without paying its mana cost. Ooh. So I'll be one, BZ can be two, Ailey could be three, Olivia's four, and then I'll reroll on five and six. Great. Cool. Oh, and tr- yeah, there we go. Oh, when I'll screen, upkeep, the BZ right? screen, oh, enters. it's a four. <laughs> four. Olivia, do you have any instant sorcery? company. Oh yeah, I'll I'll Coco. So it's look at the top four, six, six. And you want three drop creatures or less? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, this could be a whiff, folks. Wow, whiff, big whiff. But however, I Damn. didn't want any of these things anyway. So scry six. And I also got a Zafai trigger, which I should have done. I would have scryed one of those to the bottom anyways, though. So yeah, you let's can look just get one the more. Next one and then that is also not a three, so it's scry seven, everyone. Ooh. Nice. Oh god, I'll pass. <laughs> Alright, end step, it's what you've all been waiting for at home. We're activating Spell. Top four. One, two, big three. Big hits, big two, hits. Four. I believe in you, Svella. Uh, please. That's okay, I will <sighs> cast a Xenagos the Reveler. Planeswalker That's Extraordinaire. That's in terms good. of three loyalty, I will untap and draw. Alright, let's make red, green, and we'll plus Xenagos to make red, red. Ooh. So I got again, 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 four. Again. No, we're not doing that. Mm. We gotta, I gotta be a hero. Okay. I'm gonna try to cast a, a chain reaction, which Ooh. deals X to each creature, or X is the number of creatures in play. How many creatures? Three. No, it's at least three. 10. I was like, I have four on my side. I have five. So I got two. two so four. enough to kill the board? Yeah. I think so. Yep. Yeah. Nice job. I did it, but at what cost? I'm sorry, Svella. Again. Svella. One, two, three, and a red. I'm going to ignite the future. <laughs> do a triple impulse draw. One, two, three. I'm play those till end of turn. It has flashback. I guess I'll play a land, and then I'll do some more rampies. I'm going to search for two basics. Nice. Put them into play tapped. They're both going to be mountains, and that's it for me. You both have excellent choice in basics. I'm just putting it out there. They're too snazzy. So snazzy. Okay, see, I don't feel so bad about my terrible attack loss turn because everything died anyway. Calculated. Okay, let's do one, two. We're going to get Otepic Huntmaster out. Dinosaurs cost one less to cost, and I can give them Haste, which is lovely. So then, four, five, six. Come back here, bud. I will discover four. Oh, you are definitely not for Zakama. Nope. No. Oh, Keisha, damn it. Nope. Yeah, put them on oh, the wall. Oh, cool. Roman Throne. Dink. So, nice. Roman Throne enters the battlefield. Choose a creature type. Dinosaurs. Um, if a triggered ability of another creature would trigger, it triggers an additional time. I will use my green to play this here. Shali's Lore Keeper. Add one mana only for dinos. And... I'll play my land for turn as Restless Ridgeline. It's the one that can become a surprise dinosaur. That is my go. Roman oh, Throne is so cool. I like this card. Olivia, we're at act, end of Act 2 in Baldur's Gate. Nice. That's real good. <laughs> Told you. <ya. laughs> All right, Plains. Uh, I'll bring out my commander. 
GTBs, I can search my library for an ally card, reveal it, put it in my hand, shuffle. I'm grabbing a Haraboz druid. Uh, I hate that one too, I think. What does that one do? <laughs> it, uh, it can tap to add mana equal to the number of allies I control. Yeah, okay. That one's it's a gem height so sliver. See? Sliver in disguise. No. I will tap out and play Haraboz druid and pass. I am going to untap and draw. I'll pay red, blue, and then two more, and then two more. And I will bring back out Zephi. Okay. And I will pass after that. So you have two treasures and two mana? Yes. I'll draw. All right, I'm going to use these or I'm going to lose them. So I'm going to hide away. One, two, three, four. This will come back later. Watch out, everyone. When we least expect it. When you least expect it. Or if someone's dealt seven damage. I'll fertile ground this forest. So it taps for an additional of any color. Mia, are you going to counterspell me if I play like a cool spell? I think that depends. How cool is the spell and how much does it affect me? What if I didn't even know the answer? I want to flash back this. It's going to affect you enough that he needs to worry about a counterspell. All right. Well, play it and then we'll talk. I'm just going to flash back, ignite the future. So it flips the top three cards and I can play them for three. Oh, for nice. free, sorry. For free? Yeah. All three? It's like last right. time. Last time I had to pay for them, but now I can cast them for free. That's cool. But if they're lands, you know, it's a whiff. I can't. Sure you can. That resolve. You just have Aww. to say it resolves. Well, what do you, do mean, it. you want me to? Everyone I mean, wants I you like to. I hate counter spells with a passion, but you know what? You, you play how you want to I say play. do for it. Free counter spell. Trigger. <laughs> Bottom. Okay. For free, BZ? <laughs> No, it's not for free. I just spent eight mana. Did that <laughs> seem free to you? I should have changed the elevator pitch. I should have said for eight mana. I can cast <laughs> these for eight mana. I know you have chunky things in there. It's a spell a deck. All right, I'm going to use Xenagos to make a satyr. Okay. Not really sure how to draw that. Is a satyr like a centaur? Kind of. Am I thinking about something? Okay, okay. There he is. He's got like goat legs. I think that's what they yeah, have. Yeah, goat legs I... and horns, I think. Okay. Oh, put up, put up some horns. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You don't tell Anything me <laughs> how to draw this pity sliver. I'm going to pass Sater, my turn. Sater. Sorry. <laughs> Everything slivers. I wanted to do an oops all slivers game. And Olivia was just like, no. Oh, God. <laughs> Voice of I don't think we can help you with that. We do have uh, kindred <laughs> decks, though. Okay. I need some stuff to do. So I'm going to play Path of Ancestry. None of these guys come back from the yard. Checking doesn't do much. So I am going to main phase. One, two three, five. It's not great, but it's something. Uh, Return to the Wild Speaker. I'm going to draw cards equal to the greatest power among non-human creatures you control. It's only four. Yeah, pay five, get four. Not terrible. You know, it's better than pay eight, do nothing. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure, sure. That's that's very true. I'm going to cast Shifting Ceratops. It can't be countered. Protection from blue. Gains haste, uh, trample, reach, whatever. My choices for one green. I am so scrying that to the bottom. Path of Ancestry. And we are going to have this enter. Roaming Throne goes, hey, whatever you do, you're going to do twice. So we're going to wait now. Hmm. It triggers twice, but Pendlatza says it can only happen once per turn. So discover four. Hey, Marauding Raptor. Hey, buddy. This makes critters cost one less. And whenever another creature enters the battlefield, this whacks it. Well, it's going to whack it twice now. Woo! And gets plus two. Oh, until end of turn. Ha! Huh. Okay. So if so we play two twos, that'll kill them. Yeah. Right? But it's under my control. So you guys oh, are Oh, your fine. own things. Yeah. So Got my it. four toughness creatures better watch out because Marauding Raptor is probably going to kill them. <laughs> 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 hmm. Okay. I might need to rethink some stuff in this deck. Uh, let us then. Well, Olivia only has a couple. How big is Tazri? Tazri is a. Oh, yeah. You guys are nine. Enormous. She's, she is what? blue, right? Oh, she's an eight oh, nine. Door, door. No, she's white. She has all. Oh, right. She's now. got Wooberg for uh, right. an ability. And your other guys also probably like ginormous. Uh, five six. Can't actually hit you. That is so sad. It's a sad, sad situation. <laughs> I hate my hand right now. <laughs> oh, it's getting more and more absurd. I pass. Wow. <laughs> I love how frustrated you get when you can't get through on me. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to hit you. Look at your life total. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, you'll be fine. Don't worry about it. What a spicy meatball. So I'm going to tap five. Holy. Uh, hold on. Okay. 
Uh oh. <laughs> That's even worse. I don't like I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> nope. Nothing no, good happens. I just off of I've that. never been able to actually play this. Oh. And then considering if maybe I want to do this instead. Do the thing you've never done. That's way more fun. I'm gonna pay two for a pyre of heroes. So two tap sack a creature. I can find a creature card in my library with the same creature type and a CMC less a oh, one plus that creature. Oh, I thought it was the other way. Uh -uh. All right. Well, pyre of heroes then. Uh, CMC one plus that creature CMC. Uh, put that card on the battlefield and shuffle my library. Wow. So what the hell? Are you gonna eat Tazri? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> Actually, maybe I will. There's so many options here. It's not one of these I want to launch, I don't think, but I might do it anyway. I'm going to play a um, Hagrid Diabolist. So, Beezy, you're What's at up? starting life total. Let's put you at 37. <sighs> okay. That does damage equal to the number of allies you have. Yeah. But we're good. We're square now, right? That's it. Rest <laughs> of the game. We're good. For the rest of this turn, sure. <laughs> well, he still has the most life out of all of us, though, besides you, so. Yeah, so clearly still the target. Uh, <laughs> Absolutely. What'd I do to you? All right, I'm going to pay two by tapping Haravaz Druid and Pyre of Heroes. I'm going to launch Hagra Diabolist and look for a six CMC ally. Cool. I don't know if I can think of a six CMC ally. There's I one in here. Off the top of my head. I don't know allies at all, so. <laughs> I, know I don't either, and I have an allies deck. Well, I hope I didn't uh, f this up. Maybe I did. <laughs> 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 Built my pass. Good. <laughs> Boom, you're also Pyromancer. Who is that? What does that do? It's a human shaman ally that when it or another ally ATBs, I can have it deal damage to target creature equal to the number of allies I control, which is three. That's kind of less scary. So, uh... So you can wax on me for what? three? Yep. I've got a marauding raptor. Yeah, you want to kill this. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Mm -hmm. Your reaction okay. tells me I don't. Kill that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my only creature's a 1-4. I do have 2-2. Two -two. Yeah, let's launch the 2-2. Two -two. Oh, sorry, little sage. Oh, guy. man. I, I am going to respond. I'm going to convoke a spell. So I got two mana here. I'm going to try to Sundering Vitae and destroy the uh, the door. It's really big. It's a big door. Yeah. Sure. I've never seen that card I before. That's cool. don't have an answer to that. So, yep. And then Whoa. I'm going to hit Xenagos for three. Or for, he, yeah, three. He deserves it. He's going to go down yep. to one. Yes, and then I'll remove Tazri from no, combat. He should die. Oh, because I plus him for mana once, so he goes to one, yeah. Uh, yeah He's that's so it, punchable. That's... I felt emotions playing that turn. Okay, two. I'm just going to play this Goblin Electromancer, and I think I'm going to hang back and pass. All right, cool. I'm going to tap. I will draw. I appreciate the speed at which you both take your turns. So Forest. refreshing. <laughs> Yeah, I've taken too many turns, and I'm just ready to get them all over with. I've taken too many I'm just like, turns. I'm like, another turn? <laughs> oh. So, one, two, three. I just hope that my life goes to zero that fast. Like, <laughs> like, oh. like I really am. <laughs> too much magic playing, I'm done here. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> it's exhausting. Six turn max. <laughs> all right, so this is five, six, seven. It's Fella, part three. Yay! Mia, do you have a response? No. I see you have blue Whoa. tap mana. And? And I want to know if you have a response. I'm tapping okay, that well, is why I have trust you. issues. Yeah. I'm going to zero <laughs> the Xenagos and make a new and improved satyr. Okay. This one will have horns. Oh, that's cute. I like him. Now, don't destroy him. Just don't leave him alone. Him. Yeah, he's nice. Let's see. So six mana. It's Kodama of the East Tree. Uh, but that's the last thing I had. So I guess I'll maybe do a little tappies like this and I'll pass my turn. Um, tip a tap all of my crap. Please, can I have a dinosaur? Oh, thank you. Yay. Yeah, screw it. Sorry, buddy. Actually, let's do this first. Uh, Mosswood Bridge, Hideaway 4. That one's really easy to, like, cast for free. Yeah, it's gonna be this one. All right, then the others go bottom. All right. Proverbial lamb to the slaughter, unfortunately, for this friend. I'm gonna pay four. I'm going to cost Hulking Raptor. Ward 2 at the beginning of your pre combat main phase, add green, but unfortunately has a tiny butt of three. So he's going to enter the battlefield. Triggers. I. Oh, actually, it's one this because of the Otipic Huntmaster, so just untap something. Hunt Latsa, so we will discover three. Oh, that's cool. Lifecraft is bestiary. I will have that. I will enter, thriving heath to the bottom. Marauding raptor sees our lovely hulking raptor friend and goes, hey bud, catch, ding ding, and hits him twice. So he, he makes will the die. law and order noise? Uh, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> 
So he's going to get plus four. So it's now a six, three. So this will die into the bin. You go nothing else. I must remember this. I'm going to send the Marauding Raptor and Shifting Ceratops at you, Olivia. So six, three, five, four. Yeah, I'll take it. I don't care. <laughs> cool. Dink. Sweet. That is my turn, I think, because we cannot do anything else right now. Interesting. My creatures are actually two less to cast because of Marauding Raptors, so I have one more mana untapped. <laughs> I'll tap five. Seagate Lore Master. Is this the one I hate? You hate all of them. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> I'm going to go through attacks, go to second main, tap Haribaz Druid for four blue, and this planes, and I'll play Brago, King Eternal. Oh. Oh, right. Sorry. I had a Mirasa Pyromancer trigger. Um, I need to hit something for one, two, three, four. So I've got Kodama's a six, six, Seder's a two, two, Spell's a two, four. I, Commander's a one, four, two, two. Yeah. You can kill anything on my board. Great. I will. Roaming Throne. Right. Oh, it has Ward uh, two. Do you want to pay the two? Oh, I can't pay the two, so don't worry okay. about that then. You could kill something else. Ceratops, um, the Mana Dorks, Raptor, or Penplaza. Let's get your Commander. That's it, pass. I forgot uh, I was okay. going to do damage. Um, I was doing math uh, for a bit, so on end step, <laughs> I'm going to pay uh, red and blue for a galvanic iteration to flash it back. So mm -hmm. whatever I do next is going to be copied. I will pay red, red, hitting myself for one. Ding. Sorry, you scryed, right? Thank you. Keep on top. Blue, blue, and then one. And an extra, so X will be two. And I'm going to play Explosion twice. Oh, nice. So I'm going to deal two twice. I'm going to draw cards, uh, two cards twice, and then also make two four fours and scry twice. I'll keep that on top. Nice. Okay. So I got you. Let's see, it's four right now. Are we more afraid of the ally that does damage or the one that makes mana? I am hellbent, so I have no hand. You don't have ones that draw cards, right? But you can't nope. chew on them. So. I have one right now, but not, and it won't draw until next turn, and it just draws me oh, four okay. the one time. Uh, maybe the one that keeps eating our creatures? Is that four damage or is it six? It'll, it, it'll, it'll die on it, yeah. Okay, perfect. I'll, I'll aim that there, and then I will draw four, and then I'll move to turn and organize What's this. What's that guy? Was he a three, two? Yeah. Okay, you have another oh. two damage to spread around. If oh, you want. I thought he was. I thought he was bigger than that. I thought he was yeah. a three-three. Uh, is the mana one also? Dang. Uh, the mana one's a zero one. Oh yeah, I'll aim it there then. <laughs> All right. She has seventy-eight life. I actually forgot about that. <laughs> Sorry, I, I know this seems very targeting. However, seventy-eight <laughs> life is a lot. When no, this is that. refreshing. Learn how to commander damage. You'll be fine. What do you care about my life total? <laughs> I will draw for turn officially. I'll play a land for turn. I will pay one, two, and three. Oh, damn. That was yeah, a little I'll play. Jeez. Yeah, that was yeah. yeah. Woo. I'll play Vadric. So it's going to become day. Uh, but he's going to cost X less where X is his power. And he'll get counters based on whether it's day or night. No, no, no. I'm going to have to veto this day token. Oh, you okay. Do you sure. gotta do a sun. <laughs> sure. Sun and moon. That's fine. That's fine. Cool. Cool. That's super cool. It's for those viewers at home. Yeah, I'm sure that's what they really want to see. I think I'm just going to pass for that. Actually, wait, do I have punchies? I've got a 4-4 four, four, and then little idiots up. Okay. There's what, like a one ally that's like a 2-3 or something? I'm not, I'm not swinging to you, BZ. So I'll move to combat and I will swing two 4-4s four, at you. Whatever. Take it. <laughs> okay. And then I will pass for turn. All right. Let's untap these lands. Tip draw. All right. I have a similar play to what you did, Alice V. I'm going to try to do a Return of the Wild Speaker. It would say draw six. Is that cool? Ooh, nice. Yeah. Mia doesn't have a counter spell. She would have countered it because it was a <laughs> spell that I cast. <laughs> Sorry, playing a bunch for free is a little bit different than just drawing. <laughs> Why did, who tapped my eight lands if that was for free? All right, I'm going to play Classic Wolfron, which triggers uh, Kodama. I'm a good player. And then I get a forest. <laughs> I will play a Wolf Willow Haven on this forest because it's great to keep track. That also triggers Kodama. We'll put out a Finhorn Elves. We're going to play two, five, or a Shamanic Revelation. This would Ooh. say that I draw five. Sorry, draw four and gain four. One, two, three, four. All right, I will play more crap. Let's go for a Voyaging Seder. Kodama's going to trigger. Got a Wild Growth. Two, 
three. We'll go for a Garrix Uprising. I will draw a card. And then Kodama triggers. But I have nothing to put it. The creatures now have Trample, so I can Xenagos if I want to for five. Yeah, I'll, I'll plus Xenagos. We'll make five mana. I guess this Ice Cube could be six. I'll use three of it to make a second Ice Cube. And I'm just gonna let the rest go away. So then my turn is over. I just ramped oh, like- Oh, you made so much mana just to let I it go I ramped like away. nine more times. Yeah. <laughs> this is gonna be such a big deal. <laughs> wow, shots fired. To be fair, you let that go. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie. I will scribe. Because I remember triggers. Scribes at the bottom. Boop. I will draw. Six. And I'll use Path of Ancestry. Seven. Get to scry again. Okay. Now to go to the bottom. Pantlatsa comes out. I can pay green. Um, whenever you cast a creature spell, you may pay green. If you do, draw a card. Oh, I can do that. Yes. May I get that card back from the bottom that I scried there? Wow. Go for it. Yeah. Right, okay. Cheat step. <laughs> Cheat step, yes. Because I could actually get that card. That was my concern. Yeah, I will pay green. Keep this in, EK. Okay. Keep this in. <laughs> they cheat. Oh, chat. Our, our, our chat knows about the cheat step. <laughs> I will then do Pantalatsa's uh, ETB. Discover four. Land. Oh, Fiery Confluence. Choose three. You may choose the same mode more than once. Deals one damage to each creature. Ouch. Two damage to each opponent or destroy target artifact. If you dealt two damage to everything, I would have these three die. Uh, so it's two damage to each opponent. I might just want to blow up some artifacts. Okay, I know I want to destroy the Pyre of Heroes, because that's a little scary. Coward. There's no real other problem artifacts out. There's ice cubes. There are ice cubes, but nah. I want to see Svela do dumb stuff, so I'll just do the uh, deal two damage to each opponent, so you guys will all take four. Taken. Ouch. Yes. Ouch. So, but that's us triggered. She won't go again. Oh, you guys are untapped. How much of a meanie pants do I want to be? Oh, go all in. Question. All in? This is a meanie pants game. Okay, sure. <laughs> I don't know what I just signed up for, but... Let's do it. Uh, it's not good. Is She's like, deal 40 to you. <laughs> yeah, that'd be sick. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do it then. I'm going to pay the green and tap Mosswood Bridge. Play the Exiled card. The Exiled card, unfortunately, is Awakening Sun's Avatar. It wasn't cast from hand, though, so never mind. You guys are fine. Power Rumpf. Reading the card explains the card, friends. I'm still gonna do it. Got anyway, him. Ba -ba -ba -ba. This is gonna deal two damage to it. It survives that, so that's cool. Ding, ding. Plus two, plus four. Yeah, Olivia, I'm gonna just do the same thing as last time. Send these big idiots at you. Whatever. Yeah, Ding. taken. This is a play, no? You may no play problem. the X -X. Yeah, I think you should be able to pay green to draw. Pay the green. Okay, I'll pay the green and draw. Oh, friends! Yay! Forest. Discounts. Yay! It won't die. One, two, three, four, five with my discounts. I'm going to cast a raging S-word tooth. It's gonna get whacked twice. I should have done this pre-combat, but uh, whatever. It's fine. Uh, so Raging Sword Tooth enters. It deals one damage to each other creature. Roaming Throne no. sits. It's gonna do that twice. So everything uh, is I'm taking gonna, two damage. I, I'm, sorry, I'm going to yeah. respond to the cast. The cast? Okay. Yes. One, Please two. cancel it. I would like to continue participating in the game. I'm gonna three and then two reduction. I'm gonna Mystic Confluence. Uh, uh, yeah. How much mana do you have untapped? Two only. So I'm going to choose the first mode that says counter unless you pay three, and I'm going to... Let's see, you're a little scary. I, Thank you. You're welcome. I think I'll just draw two also. So okay. That is countered. My dork survive. That is my dork. Sorry, two more triggers. I got an okay. elemental and I survive also. Okay, okay. I will play this command tower. I'm going to tap Seagate Lore Master and draw three cards. I will play to Juru Archer. When it or another ally ATB is still damage the target creature with flying equal to the number of allies it controls. <laughs> Anything have flying. I think we're all grounders. Yeah, nothing here. I think we're all on the ground. All right, that's yeah. no problem. I will hit BZ in the air for two with Brago. Oh, I do have a reach. Uh, Kodama does reach. Ah, okay. Doesn't fly though. That's fine. Yeah. I will bang Mia in the air for two. Okay. 
I'll remove Brago from combat so he can remain untapped. And then I will, on my end step, flicker Tazri and find an ally. Oh, it's any number? What? Yeah, I'll do the lore master too. I was like, any number of... <laughs> any number of flickers? Let me find some allies. Yeah, I'll just find the one here and then. Show y'all and pass it. Good okay. God. <laughs> I will draw for turn. And just so everybody knows, I'm going to reveal it and it enters my hand, but nothing. No more. No more shenanigans. Okay, let's see. I have to do math right now. Yeah, get out the abacus. I've been doing so much math this game. Okay. I think it's fine. I'm going to pay three. I'm going to play Rutha. I can pay two and return her to my hand and to copy Insider Sorcery, and I can choose new targets for the copy. I love that card. She's so cool. She's she's so cool. (laughs) I will pay five total, six, seven reduction, and then tapping three elementals to make ten. And I'm going to play Explosive Singularity, but holding priority, I'm going to pay two and return her to copy it. Uh Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So... A bunch of stuff is going to happen right now. I'm going to scry... Wait, first you have okay, to I'm target s- okay. the original spell. I'm going to target Olivia directly. For 10 damage? Yes. I'm going to scry one. Make a guy. I got you. Thanks. And then I will <laughs> deal 10 damage randomly. BZ1, 2, Alia, 3, 4, Olivia, 5, 6. 1. BZ, take 10. Oops. I don't want to. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Just, just letting you know. And then I'm going to do the copy. So who's the copy targeting? I was going to hit BZ, but you just took 10, so maybe I feel like you might... Does that change anything? Yeah, it does. I'll, I'll just hit Olivia again, and then we will <laughs> do the same round of... So now it's random. Yeah. Wow, cowardice. So... Not just random. <laughs> well, I don't know. The dice really don't like BZ usually, so I'm just going to... Rock and roll. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three. Three, yeah. that's me. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I take 10. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I'm no cool. Case. That game's got to end, huh? So don't, don't, be, don't say sorry. <laughs> yeah, that was, you dealt 40 damage, right? <laughs> yeah, sorry. I probably Jeez. should have tapped like this because I'm never going to swing with these three. So I'll tap like that instead. And I think that's it. Oh, I that's it? I'm going to wow. turn. That's yeah, awesome. It wasn't that even was a good cool turn. turn. Yeah, it wasn't that good impactful. Job. Sorry. 40 really dead grab that impactful. Seagate impactful. aerialist <laughs> gives allies flying when <laughs> another ally ATBs. Okay. Let's just not think about it too hard. We'll just make some mana. So then it goes to make five. Your door spelling. Six, seven, yeah. eight. Spin the wheel. One, two, three, four. Oh boy. You know, we're going for it. It's Azuri's predation, folks. This makes a four-four for each creature my opponents control, and they all fight them. It's on the stack. Nothing? Yeah. Well, no, but I was like, everyone else has priority before I do. That's true. That's true. I was waiting out everyone else. Ew. Yeah, wipes the entire board, and he gets 10 each billion of, creatures. Each of those tokens fights a different one of those creatures. Yeah, it's like a Mizium Mortars type thing. Wow. So you're just going to take every, take everything out? Maybe. Okay, yeah. but the, some will trade, right? Yeah, everything with four power or more that you guys have, I don't profit a beast. Crap, okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, did you have any? Because I, I don't think anyone else does. I, I ain't I got nothing. Anything. All right. I guess just let me know how many creatures you guys have that lose the fight, you know, where I would keep a beast. Yeah. Oh, jeez. And I'm just now realizing that. How many creatures did you guys have total? Because they would all trigger Garrick's Uprising. Oh, crap. Yeah. Uh, seven. Four, five, six, seven. Eight. So 15. Four for me. 19? I mean, I guess if we're stacking triggers the right way, then a Kodama would trigger just for a bunch of lands. This one, and this one, and this one, and this one, and these. Okay. Grief. Spell will go burr. I'll hide away. That was painful. Good job, Svella. Sheesh. <laughs> that one? They don't have haste, and I don't have a way to give them haste. I want to just spin Svella. I'm going to just pass my turn. I will go to end step and discard a You're few things. You're not going to swing? I'm going to chill. Well, my beast can't attack, so all I have is a 6-6. Six, six. I'm sorry to bum you out. Svella. Putting in the work. I will untap. I will scry. Well, methinks we all go die die to some beastie friends over here. They are quite threatening. I'll leave that on top. I am going two, two, three, four, a topiary stomper. Uh, Life crafters beastiary says pay green, draw, and I cost. I'll do that. I'll draw this card. Topiary stomper enters, and I will go find a basic put onto the battlefield. Tapped, then shuffle. Uh, there's a basic planes. Shrimp apple. I got some blockers. It's not. It's not much, but it's honest work. What are you? Six, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh boy, do I even have that much? Sure don't. Okay, never mind. We're not going to do that for a while. I will just sit here and say go. <sighs> well then. Oh, I didn't play a land jungle shrine. Yeah, go ahead. This is all I can do, I guess. I'll march from the tomb. Oh, that's pretty Any good. Any number of allies up to eight CMC on the battlefield. Nice. You got blockers. Anything that can deal direct damage to easy? Uh, yeah, if Ailey hadn't killed I... it. What do you mean? <laughs> I can kill anything. In the deck. You can only deal four damage to him at the most, so. It's something. Yeah, better than nothing. Yeah, what what good does me hitting him for four do? Not much. I'm not sure. I, I was just think. asking, like, if you yeah. could do any, like, direct damage. Yeah, I can. I will bring back four allies. All of them are twos. So that works. So I'll get four counters here because everybody sees one another. And you could like mill me for 16, right? I am probably going to be milling you for 16. Yeah. <laughs> My deck's getting small. Uh, yeah, that's kind of what I got. Uh, I'll mill you for the 16. All right, I lost count, but it's like 21. 21 okay. left. I'll play a Sulphur Falls. All right. Yeah, that's all I got. Pass. <sighs> this game's been a good old slugfest, huh? A lot of slugs. <laughs> Let's see. I need to play Toxrill now, so I can actually nope. say that. Oh, please. <laughs> no, absolutely <laughs> not. That is a, one of the most miserable commanders to play against. That card is so brutal. Yeah. Okay, three, and I'll play See the Spoils. I'm going to discard uh, at this point. I'll discard Logic Knot. I'll draw two and create a treasure token. I am one off from what I would like to do. Land return. You're just going to swing out. Who's to say? I will put down Rutha, and I will see what happens, I guess. Pass. Right, I step. I'm going to pay Ooh, I do. Sorry, I do want to do something, and I think okay. I would have to do it first. So one, two, three, six, seven. I'll tap nine, and then I will untap this land with overgrowth. So I have an eight floating, and I'm going to try to vitalize to untap my creatures. Okay, in response to that, then, I'm going to pay three to generous gifts, Bella. You got an Arr. elephant. I get, I've always wanted an elephant. Nice. You're welcome. All right, Svella, I think, is in no more cast zone. I'm just going to throw her away. I've been getting all sorts of crap in exchange for my commander this game. <laughs> At least you're getting something out of it. It's not just dying. <laughs> There's my elephant. This will resolve then and do... Huh! Now let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... 12, 13, 14. I will use Kessig Wolf Run to pump my Kodama at 11. Boy. And then I'm going to try to Kazool's Fury it and try to deal 17 to you, Mia. Jeez. That's what we're going for. I guess I'll respond. Yeah. Wait. Well, I'm not going to die, so... You're not going to die. I couldn't get no. it high enough. So I, I went for this fellow value instead. I guess if I'm not going to die, I don't have to do anything right now. Yeah. Take. All right. Wow. So you don't 17. Nine. Yeah. Uh, and then you were dealt seven damage, so I will use Spine oh. Rock to cast a Cold Glow. Oh, jeez. Fired off the end step Cold Glow. Uh huh. Uh, does that resolve? Fighting. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to fight Rutha because you kept me. You were like, oh, I could do something. Uh, okay. <laughs> Try to think of what the best math is here then. And I, now I'm totally tapped out. Uh, what I'm thinking, I have six mana total. That's why I was saying, like, how much damage can you deal? Because on my turn, I could have dealt, like, maybe 10 to be easy, but I'm not sure if that would have, like, been better or just, like, hitting the board would have been better. Get rid of Xenagos. I can get rid of a couple beasts. I'm not sure what you guys think is the best option. I mean, yeah, if you can chip off some creatures, you know, one of us may yeah. have a fighting chance then. Yeah, sure. I'm going to tap for the two red here for three damage here, and then one multi kicker, and I'll Comet Storm Xenagos and your beast. My elephant or a beast? Your elephant, Amber. Oh, man. I didn't want her up here. Get out. <gasps> Kitty. Get out. Get out, please, Hi, and thank you. You're welcome. She wants to be famous. You're welcome, Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> she was trying to step on my board, so even though we're That's almost fine. dead, you get a that happens every time That's I play magic. So. She steps on it. <laughs> so this dies. Uh, yeah, the fight. Nice. And then you got I want to jump. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's find out if we're dead, Livia. Let's well, find out. All right. So I do have ten power. So we're gonna go for swing for the fences. Oh yeah. We're gonna try Love to cast it. an overwhelming stampede. Oh yeah. Which I would think just we're hacking dead now. Trillions, trillions, and trillions. <laughs> we won't make you math it. I think we are okay. Yeah. It's a chunk. Jeez. A chunk. I couldn't have even kill him if I aimed the 20 damage at him. 
Right, because you would have had to. Yeah. Uh, Zephyr would have had to randomly hit me again. Yeah. Mm. You would have still had seven left on you, and then. Dang. I, yeah. Yep. Yeah. No, I wasn't Jeez. getting anything. Anything fun for a while. Yeah. I would have had to literally the comet storm, Zephyr, <laughs> and the other two at you. That would have been a lot of like, huh? Maybe, maybe this is a little much. <laughs> that was sweet though. I think that what was it? A zero yeah. predation. That's yeah. That yeah. Murdered us. Jeez, that well, card has really. been like really good, and it's like forty yeah. cents or something. Yeah, it's reprinting Commander Masters. I opened a couple of them. I have them in a box somewhere, I'm sure. But yeah, nice. GG's friends. Thank Jeez. you so much for joining us. Thanks today. for joining. It was fun to be on. Thanks for having yeah. us. We have a solution for that. Give me that. Give me that. Angelic Ingenious Supplies. Oh, we got smushed. <laughs> I mean, at least the game was over fast. Oh, I'm, yeah. I'm down with an Azuri's predation, just being like, okay, we're done. Yeah. You know, overwhelming stampedes are just cooking, shut us down entirely. Overwhelming almost. Yeah. Overwhelming. It's yeah. But hey, cool, it was I, fun. I, I, Svela got to do things. I love Svela. So, you know, I'm, you know, team busy for that one. <laughs> yeah, there you go. While you're giggling, thanks to the nitpicking nerds for joining us. And uh, Ailey, what can people do to make sure that they can yell at us on the internet and new characters appear on uh, yeah. in our fighting game? Well, <laughs> <laughs> a new challenger approaches. See? I yeah, that was right pretty there. cool. Good job. I know. Uh, yeah, click the buttons, do the things that make dings, do that. And, you know, get <laughs> notified so that you can see when an adorable cat pokes his head up for scritches. Hi. <gasps> <laughs> you guys look at the void. Give this, give the I'm, void scritches. I'm giving the void scritches. Uh, do anything else, Olivia? Nope. Look at that cat butt. Oh my God, there's cat butt. Have a great week. We'll see you guys later. Kitty. Ailey and I want to say thanks so much to our patrons. We really appreciate your support in helping make Elder Dragon hijinks a thing that will continue for as long as we can play casual, ridiculous commander. Thanks again, patrons. 